everybody. Welcome back. Week 9. Sea Fix started off here at Rockingham Speedway. I saw this on the schedule. This is one that I marked and definitely wanted to do. I like Rockingham. Not always great at it, but I enjoy it. So definitely going to be running B Fixed as well. Um, still terrible to trucks. Actually, I'll qualify what I should have done. Qualified 5th. I think there's 23 in this race. Truck number 13. Second lap could have been faster, just lightly brushed the wall off of turn two, got a 0x, so it disallowed that one, but uh, not too unhappy with it, we'll see. I doubt I'll have the pace long run-wise, I'll probably get eaten up and dumped or I don't know, but hopefully we can go greens, the tire wear can be a factor. It's going to have some fun that way, 50 laps, see how caution filled this is, and uh, hope, to, hope to get the week off on a good note. These cars can be pulling off getting ready to roll off here. Okay, Jake, stay calm, focus. Go, go, go. Not a real good restart on either line. I think uh, both the leader right and the two both spun it off the start, so... Just gonna sit around the bottom, gonna have to watch getting off turn two, drop us back to six plate. See the right three. Yeah, Still off there. the corner. Still there. 13 gets sent up. Oh, line. It was a six, excuse me. Gets out on the track, so they're high. Slot in behind the three. And uh, we'll see how aggressive six the plus. 20 wants to get. 20 gets the wall, so I don't have to worry about him. We stay green. Really trying to focus on not using a ton of wheel. Turn the truck, try to keep the. Uh, the Tires as happy as possible. That lap was a 24.93. Car in front of lap time is a 24.83. Gotta watch the exits off a of turn two as well. Kinda happy just sitting here in sixth right now. Just kinda maintaining pace. Fastest lap for Hughes, 24.38. That's your fastest lap today. The guy ahead has just done a 24. Hoping that I can eight. do better at tire saving than what I did last week. Be fixed at Atlanta. So not make dumb mistakes. I hit the wall. This is still a pretty aero-dependent track, just because of how high the speeds are for the trucks. How long you're on the throttle for. The leader's just done a 24.47. Kind of running was a middle, to middle high line. Entries into the corners, cutting down. As the run goes on, we'll just kind of feel out the truck and see what adjustments I want to make. Bumps off the corners can really, if you don't hit them right, can really upset the truck. Either push you out with the wall or snap you loose. Like. Front five are pushing the pace faster than I want to go. I know I can drive a little bit faster, just uh, kind of happy with where I'm running right now. We're running a little bit faster than the 10 behind. 20's falling further back, it looks like. Really overshot turn one there. We'll have to make sure I don't get into turn two, so it's going to cost us a lot of time. Up to Ray behind is now 0 0.68. Okay, Jake. Top time's pretty Obviously consistent. Obviously, would love to try to get back to a top five if possible, but I'd I'd be happy with the top ten out of this race if I could. Just kind of see how it all unfolds. Especially if we're able to go caution free. Last lap time was at 24.82. Move this there off of turn two. Tell if the three's getting held up by the 16 or if he's just kind of content to ride behind him. Ten behind's been looking the pace up a little bit more each lap, so 
not really pulling away from him at all. It'll seem like I have a better exit out of turn two and then they gain on me through three and four. Shot way up the track that time. So, don't really gain on me that time. Got a full course caution. And we get our first out. caution. 10 down. So, at least a uh, somewhat decent start to the race. I don't think you're going to see people in the pit road yet for tires. I know tire wear can matter here, but I don't. I, I, not with 10 laps, I don't think anybody's going to be able to use the first set. Race cars out. Line up single file behind car number 03. So, not the happiest with that. I know it'll catch me back up to the front yeah. five, but I was kind of happy with the gap I had from behind. And we'll be restarting on the outside as well. Uh, looks like everybody is going to come in for tires. Huh. It's not what I would have expected, so... Follow leader. everybody just Troyer. so we're not Miss off Pitting. sequence. Watch your speed. Pit lane speed limit is 40 miles per hour. That's been my guess for strategy, but I guess 70 if feet. you go green the rest of the way and you don't pit, then you're a sitting duck. The road's kind of blind for me Box around in the corner. Five, four, three, two, one. Box now. Almost missed it. Really, really bad. So the exit's not going to be the prettiest, but we'll get out and be okay. Just need to make sure I turn in earlier if we have another pit stop. I think we're going to come out the same place we came in. Although I'd be okay if we were fifth. Then we might actually be fifth. It's like, I don't know if you can hear me, but I didn't mean to fly with you. 97, 97, a little bit hotter on the right front. Tire's not too bad, though. Apologies. Take that. Like I said, I can. really pissed me off, though, that driving in there coming right up into me. I was going to give it to you, literally. I can understand the arguments both ways. If we stay green, then I get. Coming in, and I get staying out. Got my right front too. So we me, do Chris? go up to fifth. Oh, I know. I saw that, and then he got me right after that. I was up against the wall. I can check the replay, but get the one to go next time by. So be green well, with 35 laps outside. to go. It's looking like the whole field all pit. Full course yellow, pits are open. So I get one week of All right, Jake, get enjoyment ready. of both B fixed and C lap. fixed this week here at Rockingham before uh, we go Daytona week next week. I don't know how many series I'll run at Daytona. May only do one, may do multiple. I don't know, we'll see. Kind of depends on what the rest of the schedule looks like. What I feel like running. How bad the safety rating is, but probably do at least one of whether it's B fixed or C fixed. Not really looking forward to it, so we could just want to get over with. So, this will be kind of like uh, the start of the race almost. The difference is the three's now up in fourth instead of in sixth, but we're starting fifth again. Try to have a little bit of a better start. Tire saving's still going to matter with 35 to go. Let's do what we can. Leaders off early. Green flag. Team did not get as good of a start. P5. 
five. The gap ahead. Coming up on your the bottom again. Yep. Keep it steady. Still 14, there. trying to work hard on the outside. Clear up high. Sixteen got on the loose. Inside. So we'll get on by Clear. him. On your right. Take over fourth. Clear. And stay in front of the fourteen. Got a little bit of push there out of force. Just had to lift to keep it off the wall. See what the 14 is going to want to do if he's going to drive hard or. Eep, we're in a really bad two. Comes the 14, he's going to take inside. advantage of that, go to the inside. Still there. We'll cause caution, be careful. Yeah, we'll go back to fifth because the 14 was technically ahead of us, so. We're under caution. No problem, get the inside line. Car is out. line Can deal with that. Not happy with another zero, caution, three. but it is what it is. No matter what, this still can't be worse than the uh, super late model race it's at National right, Fairgrounds. I don't know who has advantage on the restarts. Like it seems like the outside line gets going, it kind of has an advantage on the restarts, but I don't know. So, I don't necessarily hate being fit still. Wish I could have stayed ahead of the 14 and wouldn't have screwed up turn two, but. Don't mind otherwise. Nobody gonna be in pit road unless they need repairs. Not with two green flag laps. Not even two green flag laps on the tires. So the 16 to our outside on the restart. Got loose off turn two. I was able to take that spot, so negated when I screwed up with the 14. So that'll be behind us. Hopefully we'll get the two to go this time by. We can look at getting going sooner than later, not burn too many laps. Well, this is helping me it's keep right, myself man. in the top five, which is nice. It's closed. All the squeaking of brakes. These brakes are still cold. You can hear it all around. I don't know if you guys can hear it. I can. It's loud enough for me that I can hear it, and then I can hear mine as well. So I got lined up on the inside behind the three. Nice coming in this lap. Green next time. 29 at the left on the board. So drop the green flag. Try to have. Felt like I had a decent restart, so try to have another good one. Just uh, make sure I don't screw up turn two this time. I don't know if I have anything for. Two, the six, and the three, but I feel like if we can go green the way the 14 was driving, hopefully can tire save better than them. Build the ball away. Watch to see if the two's gonna go early. Make the last restart if he's gonna wait. It 
does go early. Our team gets a really good jump on the outside, so that. we're gonna sit fifth. Just take that kid up. The fourth gone. gear and settle in. Gold tires. That was what I was afraid of. Ten had a really bad exit out of two as well. So seven gets by him. Sixteen's try to get the run, not quite there yet. You've just done a twenty-five point five seven. It's like everybody's kind of migrating down the track and one and two a little bit. Kind of got a little too early of a cut down to the white line. Pushed me up out of two. Oh, it's hitting the bumps in three and four really bad, and I just jacked the truck up. Oh. Dumb, dumb me. Comes the seven as well. Still there. I not believe I did that. Same thing as I did in Atlanta. Right side. He's still there. Keep digging. Clear outside. So we'll get the run on the outside. Inside. One's gonna come flying on the inside. Truck got a better entry. Into three. Down. Just gotta let him go. Clear low. Back to eighth. Uh, I'm just tired of being stupid. All there is to it. We're halfway home. We're okay on fuel. Just hang with the one. Let's see if we can grind any spots back. Although this truck's really bad out of the corner, so tens regained everything. Battle on our outside. Outside line's clear. Just need to be smoother out of the corners. And it's gonna get the run out of turn four, goes under the inside. I'm gonna just not fast anymore. 16 with an issue, he's falling back. Still there. Outside with 10. Still there. Didn't wanna hit the wall, so it's the advantage. Kind of crowds me up against the wall. Both side, you got one. Run on him, trying to. Clean. Yeah, inside. So, yeah, ninth right. for the They're moment. The it's not navigating those bumps out of turn two very well. Hoping that I can somehow find the pace to get by the 16. This truck's definitely get loose. I need to be a little bit later with the throttle, a little bit smoother with it. Right, we're starting to feel a little bit of effects from my sliding. Just trying to catch up. Trying to figure out where the 10 is going to go. He gets really loose out of turn high. four. Get by him. He goes low to avoid him. Eighth place. If I try to get to the 16 before the 8 gets to me, 16 gets a little loose out of turn 2. 20 to go this time by. Full course caution. And we get a caution. His car is out. Line up single file behind so I'm guessing the there's going to be a bunch of people coming in now. I would assume I everybody will probably take the last set of tires. I don't think it's worth it for me to try to fix the damage. In all honesty. It's open. Like we take the tires, everybody goes in. I mean, if everybody stays out, then I'm going to stay out for the track position. But good job there, Justin. All right, two people on the matter of corners right away. Seems like nine's not very happy. One's going to come in. The leader, Troya, is pitting. Look out for the pit speed limit. Alright, we're gonna do 40, better on entry this time. 60 feet. Box in five, four, three, two, one. Box now. Slow in, but let's hit it. 
take the optional to just get out. I think the one just did two tires. I think a lot of people did two tires, it looks like. Uh, that's kind of worrying me. I don't know how far back we're going in the pack, but it looks like two tires might have been the strategy for a couple drivers. Pits are open. So we're eighth coming in. Looks like we're eighth still. One took two tires, is up in the lead. I want to say the 14 took two tires. I could be wrong about the 14, though. So I had about 14 seconds, 15 seconds of optional, so. Just try to make the do with what we can. We'll have 16 to go once we get the green flag. Just try to be a little bit smarter on the tires, not slide them so much, and try not to tag. Wall, hit the bumps the right way, try to maintain 8th, first time restarting on the outside this race. Hopefully I can try to Full course my way around the 16. I gotta assume the 16's gotta be a little more hurt than me. The damage on the right side, although I'm sure my truck probably doesn't look very good either. We were kind of catching them, but not at a big rate once he got settled back in. I'll try to do what I can to uh, see if I can get by him. Okay, Jake. Pick up get one ready. spot, finish seven. Eighth would still be within that top ten goal, but I'm going to take and try to get whatever I can. People are going to be a little more aggressive on the tires now that we've got. Less laps to go. Can't go qualifying pace right off the bat, but I think you can definitely push. Push into the corners a little bit more. Lean on that right front a little bit harder. Let's try to get some heat into the tires. Heat into the brakes. It was the six up ahead. Oh, I'm just blinking. Right, get ready to go. So the outside line gets a good restart. One's got his first time up front. Off rolling. Outside line did not get a good restart. It's going to give the 10 an opportunity to get by me on the inside. Our inside, keep high. Inside to do what I can on cold tires. The driver in front of us is Stanch. Hold your line. Not quite clear of the 10 yet. There, we got by the 10 at least. So this is back to 8th. 16 is definitely slow. Try to find a way around him if I can. On your right. Okay, the inside isn't going to be in the way, but. Right side. Try to set it up off a of turn 2. Still there. And it gets the wall, 10's going to look to the still outside, there. we'll see if the 10 drops in behind me to get by the 16. He's still there. Keep it steady, still there. Just trying to work the bumps. Still there. We go drag racing down the front stretch. Still there. Seventh position. That sideline's clear. Coming up on your That's the new fastest lap for Troy. I don't there. know if I drifted up Troy, or if he turned down. Loose again off a of turn two. Just trying to hang on to the throttle as best as I could. Now all I can hope is that he holds up 10, buys me a little bit of a gap. That's your fastest lap. Got a little bit more of the line that I did run in qualifying. 14 to the 7, we're going to go side by side momentarily, 3's just ahead of them. One's still leading, 2's hanging on to 2nd. Leap the six and third. Ten. Still stuck behind the 16. I just don't... I think the damage is enough that it's kind of affecting my pace along with the fact that I'm just 
not driving as well as these guys, but I'm trying to get up there. Got four tenths back to the 16. P7. Decent exit out of tier 2 that time. Caught up to the 14 a little bit. Chuck really rotated in the middle of 3 and 4 there. It was a good run. That was a 24.60. Blinker up ahead. Three tenths back of the 14 still. Nine to go. I really hope we can just stay green the rest of the way. Still six tenths ahead of the 16 and the 10. Over to three a little bit. Nowhere near as good of a run. Just the 14 pulls away slightly. Your lap time was 24.81. on the 16 that time. The team looked like he pushed a little bit that time into turn three, so gained a little bit of time on him. Not a great turn two there. Should have been able to gain more time on him. to get back to the throttle a little bit earlier in the middle of three and four to try to catch on them. Got a slow truck down low. Pim really gain on the 14 that time. He's gonna go down to the bottom to defend. Right Cut underneath here, off a turn two. He's still there. Still there. Clear up high. Now I gotta defend the bottom for the crossover. Arlo. I opened up the clear. bottom. The long time was at 25.16. For the moment, we're in sixth. It's probably the best I'm gonna do since we're a full second back okay, of the Jake, seven. The next car is Campbell. Three to go. Uh, I feel like I could have easily had a top five out of this, just threw it away dumb driving, but happy that so far I've been able to recover to 6th place. Two laps to hang on to that, pulling away from the 14 behind as well. Two to go, that lap time was 25.05. Technically making up time on the 7s, just not, not enough laps for as big of a gap as there is. But gonna keep digging. Always prepared for seven to have an issue. White flag. White flag, one more lap. That lap was at 25.14. Sixth place. I mean, the six are going side by side up ahead. I would have needed like probably another 10 laps or so to try to get to the 7 and get by, but after falling back, I'll take 6th place. That's it. Um, We're done. Close to the top 5. Could finish that way. Wish we could have had a long run to see what I could have done tire saving wise, but obviously just made too many crucial mistakes, so. 
I just want to apologize for his race. I messed up. I had, like, I'm going to take a look at how I set up the pass on the... It was the 11th? Yeah. Let's take a look at that. Sorry again there, number 6. Look at that. Last couple laps is pretty good there. Alright, so we got the 11 up ahead. Sorry, I appreciate it. I was catching him quite a bit out of turn 2, and even turn 3 and 4 as well, so... This was kind of a me start and learn race strategy, kind of figuring out where I was stronger than him and how to set that up. So, got a good run. He was going to block here. But she really wasn't throwing a block. He was just, you know, going to go run a little lower than what he had been, which is what he's supposed to do. Got a good enough run here. He got, I don't know if he was, like, late on the throttle or what, but got a really good run off of turn two. And as he went up, I was able to cut it down. See crossover. Made sure I didn't get on the throttle too early to not push up and open that bottom back up. Almost did open it. Like I, I should have been running middle of the, the track like he was doing the last lap to kind of defend that bottom a little bit more. But got into turn one a lot better than him and was able to start separating away from him. So take that. Um, let's, see, let's see what else. It was a good run to the end. I was pretty happy with that. Let's see, we were fit here. Yeah, you can see there, I just got loose off of turn two. This will be the spot when I lose positions. Let's see, the 11 was just up ahead. You got the 16 coming. I think the one as well. Just leave my tag wall here off of turn four. Yeah, just slightly. So watch that. Get it with uh, just just hit the bumps the wrong way. Too much throttle too early, and the truck just sent just pushed right out. So. Looks like, uh, basically pancaked it right rear slightly more than right front, but both of them, thankfully not a, uh, 2x, just kind of pancaked it, so. 16 and 6 both get by, then there's the 1 right behind. Tried to, to get back to the inside of the 6. You can see the 1 just really sending it hard on the outside. And then he just gets a really good run off by that higher entry. Allows him to cut underneath. And I, I can't do anything at that point. He just planned that pass perfectly. It's kind of the same way that I planned the pass on the 11 out of turn 2. So. Tires, I mean, you can look at them. I, I was leaning on them pretty hard. It's 91-94. You know, it's not the balance that I was looking for. But again, leaning on them pretty hard. Uh, one thing I was going to show you guys. Did do 16-1 to 1 plus 7. 16 one for me with being the smaller diameter wheel plus seven for personal preference in the 55 I was pretty happy with move the brakes back allowed me kind of slow the truck in rotate it a little bit without it being too too much to the rear locking it up so hopefully you guys enjoyed that one let me know if you run this uh, how you enjoy it and uh, like I said I'll definitely do be fixed here hopefully uh, not make as many dumb mistakes and, and try to get a little bit of a better finish out of that so love to hear from you guys and until the next one I hope all your laps are fast your races are clean and your finishes are good Thanks for watching.